What's up, y'all? I'm back with another video. Today, I'll be talking about the things that's wrong with enemy dimensions and what they should add to the game to make it better. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe and join my Discord. I'm trying to hit 500 subscribers by the end of the month. I feel like we could do it, but let's get right into the video. So my first problem with the game is time challenge. Time challenge is not really a game mode that we can have fun in or get rewards in that really matter. Honestly, I think they should let us get trade tokens from it or other things like accessories, maybe. They might as well add characters to it, maybe. Just like boss rush. My second problem with the game is boss rush in boss rush we had the same characters for about like two three years now and they're terrible and also the same accessory the tree accessory is terrible as well i feel like they should at least cycle through the characters every single week like maybe that could be a weekly thing or a daily thing just like the fruits or something like that but yeah My next problem is there's not enough game modes that we could grind in. As a high level player, all I could really do is dimensions and reads and get better and try to get higher on the leaderboard. I feel like they should add a game mode where we could challenge each other, like PvP or something like that. Just a grindy game mode. Alright, so my next problem is speed raid drops. I feel like these should let us drop characters inside speed raid because it's too hard to grind for every single speed raid character. Honestly, I feel like it's a waste of time and it's honestly BS how long we have to grind to get a character. So, like for Sung Jin Woo, you have to grind six months to get enough speed raid tokens just to get Sung Jin Woo. So, pretty crazy how long you gotta grind for. And I think they raised the prices of the speed raid characters because it used to be 2,500 if I'm not tripping. Also, I feel like they should add more rewards to this because some people hit it too early all right so next is codes i feel like codes take too long to come out i think it takes like at least a month for each code to come out or probably longer that's way too long they need to lower the likes i feel like they should just lower it because new players are starting to come and old players are starting to lose their double xp and double drops and stuff and we need more codes in the game so yeah i feel like they should make it a weekly thing or a two weeks thing but yeah I'll say this is probably one of the worst problems I have in a game right now. It's not that bad of a problem for me, but for probably lower levels or medium tier levels, probably so hard for them to get traits on characters because of the trait pity. It's 1,300, which is absolutely absurd and crazy, honestly. I feel like they should definitely change it to like 1,000 at least or 900, just so other players can get a chance of getting celestial trait and stuff like that. But yeah, I feel like they should change that for sure. It's a big problem. next problem i have is infinite honestly the problem i have with infinite is the amount of trade tokens i get and the rewards i get from infinite honestly cards i feel like we should be able to drop mythical cards from it and i feel like they should change the accessory for it it's not that good also i feel like we should get way more trade tokens my max amount of raid tokens for wave 190 is about 1500 i believe and that's daily that's not that good for that high of a level i feel like they should definitely change the amount that we get from it and yeah Next problem I have is daily challenge. Honestly, the amount of trade tokens we get from daily challenge is terrible. I think my max amount of damage was almost 70 billion and I only got 600 trade tokens from that. That is insane, honestly. I feel like we should get at least 1,200 from it. Honestly, it's BS that we have to grind that hard to get that amount of trade tokens. I feel like they should up the amount that we get daily. Honestly, kind of crazy how much we get. so lastly we'll talk about weekly and daily quests honestly i feel like they should add more weekly quests because i finished them in like a day or two they're not that hard to complete and i feel like we need more weekly quests because they're too easy also daily quests i feel like they should add more just because it's so easy to get the daily quests and people might need more gems and stuff like that i feel like they should up the difficulty for higher levels or add more rewards for higher levels honestly i think that will be for the best i think higher levels are looking for more things to do so adding daily and weekly quest will probably be the best thing for them if y'all agree with some of the stuff that i said in this video let me know type down in the comments and let me know what you think they should change or add to the game to make it better honestly for the past updates they weren't that good they should add something better like a game mode a new game mode that we could grind and stuff i feel like they have the opportunity to make this game so good but yeah don't forget to join my discord on the way to 500 subs i feel like we could definitely get there sub up but yeah thank you for watching the video and peace out